Hello guys, welcome back to the All the Task Quest. Picking up from where we left off and we're just mining down or chopping down all these trees for the usages of production and uh, other stuff. Mostly for production though, because actually jungle wood is more in use for production because you can get large quantities of it. <gasps> oh guys, 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 guys. Intense start to an episode. Not as intense as three. Oh no! I gotta fill in this hole. This is hard mode. Hard mode does this to us. Which is why we need to keep getting dirt from underground and everywhere every time we're mining. So if we need to get dirt, underground's the best place to get it because it's nearly worthless. I like, I like how stuff defy gravity in this game. We're good. We took a blow. We're doing this all without armor. You got all of the enemies chasing from all fronts. We got enemies. <sighs> oh, dude. We got an Enderman teleporting around. Hopefully we didn't anger him. I think in the sound test that's what we did. Or the super secret options. Ooh, can't see anything. Actually I can. Is the brightness dialed up, or is it still on moody? It's still on moody, but for some reason I can see really well out here. I don't know if you guys can see- <gasps> I know you guys can see that! Um... Go away. Go away! Oh, last strike. Okay, that's good enough. Ooh. Harvesting in the nighttime. I really like these days. Really like them. <laughs> At least it's almost daytime. It's gonna be boring as soon as we get a bed. Well, unless we're gonna be building in nighttime. Because now all this nighttime battles will be gone! And we'll just be building. Better not get a bed then. Oh! Thing is though, if there are like a hundred creepers chasing after you, you better go to bed. And I remember now that we're still battling, okay? Because there's still zombies out there that still need to despawn. Oh. What was I gonna use these resources for? Yeah, oh yeah, I remember. Sticks. <sighs> Good fight! Good- Oh! People are trying to be sneaky on us. Okay. Yeah, so what we're gonna do um, is we're gonna make sticks and charcoal. Uh, we'll make half the. We'll make one eighth of these sticks because um, I'm not gonna need that very many. <gasps> <sighs> <sighs> uh, 
traveling workbench. Uh, oh, that was a huge waste. Um. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's all cool. Everything's good. It's not like we're all gonna die here. Let's make four shovels. Let's throw this flower into a chest. And this piece of dirt. Stack. Okay. We'll stack more dirt in. And... Okay, so we made shovels, right? I think I need one last shovel. And... An axe, because we've been using the axe quite a bit. And let's just repair this old axe with this one, so we get a new axe right away. All I've been eating is all the flesh. Ah, whew. And we're gonna need to form the frame first. And actually, um, let's put a lot of this stuff away first. Just, just throw them all in. We don't need the bow right now, so we're gonna transfer this all back to four. Yeah, so, that's my organization. That's how it works, always. Uh, dirt we need. Sticks. Torches. Torch coral. still raining now. Okay, now we got our resources. Um, let's go line this. Let's continue in this place. Oh, or, or digging. Why not? Because that's our plan. I really like Battlefield 2, I, I want to continue playing that game. Even though, I've heard of the new Battlefield 4 that's coming out, and people say that's the big release for the Battlefield, because, um, well, that's in the YouTube commercials, but as well as also real people are also doing this as well. They say that Battlefield 4 is going to be a new thing. It's going to be kind of like Battlefield 3, but with uh, newer mechanics and stuff. And it really, it's really gonna improve the strategy of the game. And the new, the con new command, like Battlefield 2, the new command area. Or, or actually, the revisited command screen. is gonna be really cool. I've seen. And, Especially with the Battlefield 3 interface, that's gonna make it really, really intense and realistic. I guess, I don't know, I've never been at war before. But, I heard it's gonna be really good, it's gonna be better than Battlefield 3. I'm not sure I believe them though. Um, don't get me wrong, but there have been a lot of mis misconceptions about a lot of games these days. Like, for example, there's, um, unfortunately, there's this one game, uh, Fire Emblem wasn't as good as it was before. Well, I mean, Awakening is not as, uh, what do you call it, good as the original Fire Emblem. And some people's opinions, World of Warcraft is getting worse and worse every time. I mean, Warcraft is always gonna be really, really good. Warcraft. 
I'm gonna fix the glitch, guys. I'm gonna fix the glitch. Anyways. Sorry about that. Looks like this will be a thing about watermarks these days. Yeah. I don't know if they got a newer version of Bandicam, but when this happens, um, it quickly adjusts. It's a lot harder to track your time, but whenever the I have to restart watermark or anything, I know that 10 minutes has passed, or the watermark is queued, I mean, I know that 10 minutes has passed, and it's really easy tracking, so I guess that's good news for Minecraft. And I remember I had to restart watermark twice. It's still raining out. Get this rain out of my way. <laughs> I'll be right back and I'll finish this up. I'll eat some food before I do so, though. Okay, guys. I'm queuing you back for the final battle at night. And as you can see here, I'm just clearing out the stone. I finished clearing out all the dirt. And... Yeah. Like I said, use stone picks on these. Don't use valuable resources. I know it takes a long time. But for useless... Like, for example, um, we're gonna be mining obsidian. And a lot of it for our new designs. Some of it for the beacon, some of it for the enchanting table. But the whole point is, we're gonna be mining obsidian like it's our job. I, I don't want this place to be blown up, so... This is the only reason why I'm lighting places right now. Before, I'd used to light places because so that mobs won't spawn while I'm working. But, the reason why now is so that stuff won't get blown up in the process. Because we all know that fighting in the... And the night is always the thing. Is always the thing. Rain stopped. Here we go, guys. Intensity rises from beneath the underground world of the Nether. Oh, another the reason why to mine obsidian is because of the Nether. All enemies are called upon to attack the crazy. Minecraft character of Lashina. Our first contest. Our first contestant wants to contest upon this. This very day that it may help change our world forever. Well, she might respond, but she'll lose all her levels, which is what we want. <laughs> I've yet to get better at English. Well, not very exciting today. I guess because we lit all this area up for the... For mining processes and stuff. And this this cabin will expand to higher heights and to newer heights. And then eventually I'll promote it to castle. I think you guys get the fact that... Um, uh, you only sacrifice 3 cobblestone to mine 24. And so that gets you a lot of cobblestone for about a few picks of stone picks, worthless picks. Which is, which is really, really, really good for your resources. And your diamonds too, especially when you need to use it for swords and armor. And I know iron, only in an abundance of iron you, you will use <sighs> railway track. Oh, railway across the ocean! That would be really cool. That would be really cool, yeah. 
really across the ocean would be really cool. Um, it's a really nice design plan. I see you guys. <gasps> Behind! Distraction! <sighs> okay. I know I heard that zombie. You know that skeleton's right there. <sighs> I don't know, I don't want that to happen. Come on, put it on the floor, will ya? There was a glitch in one of the snapshots where torches couldn't be placed on the ground. They had to be placed on the wall if it was in on the But they fixed that. Apparently there's a layer of dirt underneath the stone. I guess that's just to spawn the mountain up the stone. And the dirt was supposed to be for um other purposes other than this. Carve straight into a mountain. Look at me with all these design plans. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I really love tech class. Um, I like building stuff. The most perfect of the, what do you call it? One of the d designs that I had in tech class was the aluminum cube. And it was just like a piece of jewelry, even though it was just aluminum. Cheap aluminum. You can you can turn cheap materials into something amazing, which is what we're gonna be doing right about now. Uh, that's so cool. We're carving into a mountain. Eventually, this mountain will all go go to waste or go away. I mean, because. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be expanding, like I said, I'm gonna be expanding this area out more. Oh, and I also found out that, um, I just remember this now, um, each um, day and night cycle in Minecraft is 8 minutes, so when you're recording and your watermark is 10 minutes... Where's that skeleton? Looks like I defeated the dead already. You're so scared of me that I respond that. Nah. <laughs> oh wow. Except that creeper though. It's a spy. I see you, man. I know what you're gonna do. Don't tell him that. Okay, um. Eight. So going back to the aluminum cube, I guess. Um, Skeleton trying to disrupt our conversation. Stay quiet. I hear him. I don't know if this works. But I guess it does. Usually in Minecraft you get this uh, C418 music popping up. So 
does that creeper from before. Oh! Yeah, that's right. You, you, you stay away. Burn in the sunlight or something. Anyways, it's almost sun. Which should be the end of our final battle here. With a spy. This is a really intense spy battle, I guess. <sighs> I don't know. But anyways, I'll remember from before that I will uh, restart the watermark every time the sun goes up and down, no matter what. Now that will that'll really help. So anyways, I guess I'll call this the end of this episode. And don't forget to like, comment, or subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.